Back in the country, the ideological clash between President William Ruto and his deputy regarding Gashagwa on key issues of national concern, including the sentiments on national unity, political tourism, the future of the country, as well as Gashagwa's one man, one vote, one shilling campaign, has escalated in a period of less than a month. Baraka Jameson Falls. <laughs> May 25th, the year 2024, will be remembered as the date when the Deputy President Rigari Gashagwa strongly criticized political tourism, ordering members of parliament to stay in their constituencies, a statement publicly opposed by his boss a week later, as he encouraged members of parliament to visit and tour other regions. Na washauri wabunge wetu, tekeleza wajibu wako katika constituency yako. Lakini vile vile, tekeleza wajibu wako wa oversight tekeleza wajibu wako wa legislation kwa wa Kenya wote na ni lazima uwaelewe na utembee Kenya ndio uelewe kila mtu achuge constituency yake stay in your constituency kila mtu amechaguliwa kwake what we don't want is political tourism the two also seem to be reading different scripts after the deputy president in his mother language predicted to see darkness a statement heavily criticized by President Ruto, who stated that the future of Kenya is bright, while his call for bishops to pray against the dark prophecies appearing to directly target Rigathi. The future of our nation is great. We are a great nation. We are a blessed country. Wale wanao tutabiria giza na kututabiria maovu kulembele. Hizo ndimi naomba maaskofu muombe zikome. Additionally, their remarks concerning the theme of unity has differed, with President Ruto prioritizing national unity while his deputy focusing on the unity of the Mount Kenya region. It is also unity to enhance our relevance in the national political discourse. Because when we are united, we are able to successfully bargain for our share of the national cake, as it should be. Let us focus our energy. Let us focus our attention in the transformation of Kenya not in the division of our country. And this country is made up of regions. Regions are made up of counties. And therefore, we'll cultivate for unity bottom-up. Since in the bottom-up people, we have to change. We have to count, we have to change. We have to change the region, we have to change. We have to change national, we have to change. This tug of war between the president and his deputy has left many Kenyans with rhetoric questions with calls across the country urging them to come clear on what's really happening. James Baraka, KUTV News.